Hey, it's the car cast today. Let's talk about some mindfulness. Mindfulness! Let's drive. Get down. Get down. Get down. My wife is my biggest cheerleader, supporter. She is my executive assistant. She is my mentor in some areas. She's awesome. I love my wife. Love you, Janine. Um, but, and she challenges me, right? So she sends me, last night I was writing something. Uh, got a little text on my phone. She was upstairs, was downstairs, and she saw an article. Um, it was about time management, I think. I forget, but the article was about this idea of being mindfully focused, right? So it was actually quite a, a good article. What I found interesting about this piece was that the woman, and I forget, you'll forgive me, ladies, uh, that wrote the piece. Uh, it was an interview between two, and I'll post it. You know what? I'll put it up over here. Bing! <laughs> Save myself the effort of dropping in the sound effect there. Um, so if you're on the YouTubes, you can click through and find that article. Uh, otherwise, I will post it down below if you're on the Facebook machine. At any rate, um, the author talks a lot about different spiritualities, right? And what's interesting about that is that if, regardless of what your, uh, your belief system is, the deeper and further we go into them, whether it could be something like Scientology, which I don't know anything about, uh, Buddhism, uh, Christianity, whatever, but the deeper you go into these systems, there's an element of being ordered towards right thought, if you will. And I'm, I'm kind of butchering it, right? So why does that matter for today's car cast? Well, here is where I think the takeaway is for all of us. That this idea of being mindful in the moment, in other words, right now, where am I headed? I'm driving to meet a friend of mine to discuss a couple of things about my business, what he's got going on, mostly kind of a catch-up thing. Uh, but there's a purpose involved, right? The purpose is I would love to get him a little bit more involved in my business. Well, you know, I, I don't know if that'll happen or not, but if I don't take this drive to meet him, uh, that conversation would never happen, and I would never get to a yes or no on that or entice him to, to come and, and um, join me a little bit. So that's the purpose of where I'm heading, but what am I doing at the moment? I'm doing you know, two birds with one stone. Here I'm also sharing this very idea of the car cast. So now let's look at the car cast, right? Why do I do the car cast? Well, I do it for a number of reasons, right? First, and completely self-serving, it's to let you know who I am a little bit, what I think about and what I do. Uh, I'll be completely honest, there's a utilitarian nature in this. It's purposeful. The more I produce content, the more people kind of get to know who I am, maybe are interested in my line of thought, my perspective. But uh, a secondary element, and really you could argue that it's really uh, primary A or primary B, is to communicate to you some of the things that I hope will challenge you to examine the areas of your business, of your career, of your personal and professional development that are going to help you move in the right direction. And I order it all against kind of the big story of what I try to do, which is help my clients and my uh, customers, and whether it's a large company or whether it's a solo entrepreneur, tap into their ability to tell their story. Because when they're able to tell their story, like I'm telling to you right now, right, they're able to be more purposeful in how they're serving their marketplace, right? So now let's bring it all the way back to this article about mindfulness. If we don't practice that in our heads to get into this idea of why am I doing this very thing that I'm doing now? And how can I kind of reinforce uh, that notion of the why I'm at it continuously and no matter how small or big the task might be if we're not able to do that we kind of meander and get distracted now look here's a piece of transparency for you today and I'll maybe do this one for another time I'll kind of give you the meander thought I get distracted very easily I don't, I don't know if it's like a formal ADHD type of thing but I get really easily distracted I'll start to investigate something here and I'll end up completely over there and I'll forget how I even got there right and it's because I don't practice this very thing I'm telling you. I need to be mindful about what am I doing, what am I researching, why am I watching this video or reading this blog post, what's the intent and the purpose, and then allow myself to be in that moment for that purpose, but always reconciling back to the reason of what I'm doing. So there you have it. Be a little bit more mindful today. Communicate that with your team, with your, uh, with your customers, whoever it might be, with 
with your boss, with your the people you lead or manage, whoever it is, with yourself. As a matter of fact, start with yourself, and I think you'll see big things happen. Awareness, center of that. The hell was I? Huh? <laughs> Just kidding. I'm distracted. Get it? But not distracted driving. No, seriously, I'm parked. Must really dig the car cast. You made it this far. So I'll tell you what, do me a favor. Jump on over to my YouTube channel. Here's the address and subscribe. And you know what? If you're on Facebook, share this. I'd really appreciate it. Take care. See you next time.